Hey there, many X viewers. You're watching the Main Man Channel. It's not just the name, it's the way of life. you got to improvise, adapt, and overcome each and every day just to make it in this cruel old world. So, that being said, topic of today's video is... I brought out the little Glock 44, the little small versatile Glock 44. And what we're going to do is, we're going to take and uh, we're just going to paint on some steel. And I got some of that CCI Blazer 22 long rifle. It's just 50, it's a, actually it's just 40 grain round nose lead and i'll show you what one of those look like loaded up in the magazine so like i said i just brought out 50 rounds of it and uh we'll definitely be using and see if they're getting any better our uh pro mag 18 rounder glock 44 magazines and uh, i've got one full i got two of those loaded up I think I might have squeezed 19 into one of them. Who knows? But anyway, I got two of those loaded up, and then I got two of the factory mag Glock magazines loaded up. One of them full, and then one of them with five in it. But I'll shoot them in the end to show you that the Glock 44 functions just fine, even though it's dirty as crap with the factory magazines, if we have any trouble with those two Pro Mag magazines. But anyways... Those pro mags are supposed to be 18 rounders. We've 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 had some ups and downs with them. They got a little better, but uh, we'll see if they got any better this morning. But anyway, y'all check me out on Patreon, uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Uh, excuse me, Twitter, Parlor. I appreciate y'all support there, and uh, let's get to it. All right, first one is going to be one of those pro mags. It chambered. All right, here we go. We're just gonna be plinking on some steel. Well, she run all that, no problem. I missed a few, though. This thing's so light. That trigger pull's so good. <laughs> all right. So that first pro mag ran fine. All right, let's run this other pro mag. Let's step up her game a little bit, too, with it. And see if we can't get it to malfunction. I'm going to shoot a little bit faster this time. But I'm going to have better grip on my Glock this time, too. All right. So, that being said, that pro mag ran just fine. So, evidently, if you put about 50 rounds to them, clean them, keep shooting them every now and then, these pro mags work pretty good for range mags. But they ought to work right out of the package. But anyway, I just figured I'd fool with them, get them to run them, because I wanted some extra mags that were cheap for my Glock. And I guess I found them. Anyways, now we're going to the factory mags. Okay. So, we've been doing a little rapid fire with this thing. We're going to slow down a little bit, do a little one-handed fire with this full mag. See what we got. See if I can't hit some of those little ones. Ooh. I hit that bar at, at bottom little one, which is the same size as that green one. That's pretty good. Let's see if I can hit that green one there. Well, 
For the life of me, I couldn't hit that green one. But I'm happy I hit that small one. Maybe because that green one is is a darker color than the rest of them. Maybe that's why I'm having trouble. Maybe my eyes are... I don't know what. All right. So we got like five more in this one. Let's challenge yourself a little bit. You see that one that's hanging with the broke hanger? That little jack-o'-lantern? That little plate right there? Let's see if I can't get all five of them on that guy right there. Challenge myself a little bit. Here we go. Well, we got three out of five on there. But anyway, point of today's video was just have a little fun and uh, check out this uh, these Pro Mags again. See how my Glock's doing, even though it's dirty as crap and I ain't cleaned it yet. My Glock 44. And guys, I'm telling you, this little Glock 44, manufactured after May 1st. If you get one, one that's manufactured after May 1st, you're doing good. Uh, runs just fine, especially with the factory mags. And you can get those Pro Mags to work if you put a little time and effort into them. But you put a little time and effort, frustration and stress to get them working. But anyway, like I say, you're watching the Main Man Channel. This has been this cold morning plinking with the Glock 44 with the uh, Blazer 40 grain, 22 long rifle. And I want to thank y'all for watching. Check me out on Patreon. Uh, check me out on Patreon, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Parlor. And I'll catch y'all next time. Thanks.